Hey guys, one man, one camera here. So today I wanted to try a chippy. So I hustled my bustle down to Henderson to a place called the God, the Codfather, Cod, COD, the Codfather Fish and Chips. Eating outside because music's on the inside. So I got me a plate of fish and chips. Check it out. Check it out. Here's my cod and me chips. Me chips. Haha. <laughs> my chips. I got a cola. And voila, as the French would say. So I got some uh, tartar sauce, ketchup, and let's see how it is. Now these things are hot. Oh, hot, hot, very hot. So a little bit of salt. It's very hot. All right. So tartar sauce. Give it a taste. And once again, I'm someplace which is on the flight path to the airport. The story of my life. Now, see, this is hot. See this? Good and hot. Tartar sauce. Pardon my fingers, as they say. Mm. Fish is hot. The batter is crunchy. And the fish is cooked. Mm, 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 mm. So the last uh, fish and chips I had a couple weeks ago at a casino. It was really bad, in my opinion. I think it was pre-cooked, and then it sat around for a while. Then they heated it in the oven or something because the batter was extremely hard, extremely. And then when I opened it up, there was no steam, so I presume that it was uh, made earlier. So I wanted to try this place for a while, and then I finally uh, decided today to make it down here. This whole thing was $13.50 plus tax, so $14 and change. And this is Henderson because I always forget what the border is, but we are near, I think we're two miles east of Sunset Park. If that's any uh, indication, we're two miles east of the airport. I know a lot of folks use their hands or knife and fork, but pff, hey. Mmm. It's always wonder, well, what makes a good fish and chip? Well, first, your taste buds, first of all, right? Second is that the batter should be crunchy, not hard. It should be hot when it's served to you. Yeah? Not cold or rewarmed up or any of that crap. Mm -hmm. Now the fries, they're just okay, all right? They're just okay for me. Not great, just okay. So before I came down here, I was thinking, you know, about all of my fish and chip exploits. Mm -hmm. I remember I ate salt fish and chips as a kid, you know, and the vinegar and so on and so on. So, mm, good. And I actually had fish and chips in London once. Years ago, met some friends traveling in London, and then they were there before me, traveling somewhere, and they had to do laundry. Went to, went to like a coin laundry, I think, and then went to the pub next door, and got an order of fish and chips. <laughs> we did, we demolished that thing. It was fun. And then when I was in Tokyo, some little pubs sold fish and chips, kind of like so-so, but there was this one cafe that I would go to during lunch. They had like a fish and chip thing, a huge piece of fish. I don't know what kind of fish it was, but it was huge. And chips were like 10 bucks back then or so. It was huge. I go there every couple of, uh, you know, a couple of weeks and have one. But it was delicious, you know? And then in Thailand, a lot of guys from the UK would, you know, relocate there and open a chippy shop. And so it was really good. I got paid like three bucks or $3.40 for a, uh, a big uh, hunk of fish and chip. Fish and chips. I'm gonna go to Sunset Park and try to make a live, maybe. 
test the signal, see how it is. I try to do it live once a week now. I quite like I quite like this tartar sauce. It's quite good actually. <coughs> quite delicious. Mm -hmm. Quite, quite, quite delicious. It's got a warm day, about 88 degrees. Blah. It's not crazy hot, so that's good. So wow. Uh, it's not too bad today. Oh god. This is my first time over here in this area. It's interesting. You know, I was riding down, and so uh, I really should have filmed it. Maybe next time I will. These nice little neighborhoods just uh, out and about as I whiz right past them. You know, it looked pretty good. Some big houses too. I was surprised. But maybe this area was uh, cheaper years ago, and so they just made bigger houses, right? So I don't know. Right? I don't know. Now at super wide. <laughs> All right, you guys, now we'll just about do it. Make the other way to say, see me outside, say hello, and I'll say hello back. Take care, wherever you are. Have a great day. <laughs>